Hi guys, how you doing? Um, I am a little saddened to tell you that I've had to record this video now and include it as a last minute edit on the episode this week. Um, sadly, I've been trying to upload the episode to YouTube like four or five times already and I keep getting hit with a copyright notice and uh, they're basically blocking the video each time. I've gone back and re-edited like four or five times and still I cannot get around this. I am a little saddened by it because I'm delivering a video of you know of a reaction that you cannot listen the music to um, but it's 10.30 in the UK right now and I don't have time to record another episode and, and deliver on time. Uh, so what I'm going to ask of you is first of all say sorry because I am not used to delivering um, videos that I think are not up to the quality that I would like to for you guys or that you deserve. Um, and I'm just going to invite you to go to the description box below and find a direct link to Eva Farnas Chavo, the original song you know, watch the video, listen to the song, and then come back to this video if you feel like it and watch my reaction, okay? So once again, I am sorry uh, and hopefully this will not happen again because I am not doing another reaction to a music video, okay? <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you for your support. Because it is, wow, that's a great line. I actually, I actually got goosebumps with that line. Wow, that's heavy. Boom, Chesh Luja, what's up people? Hola, Vigo's dad here, welcome to another episode. Guys, today we're gonna do a reaction video. I'm going to react to a song titled Chavo by Eva Farna, Eva Farna, yes. You know, I've seen around the internet, on social media, I also follow quite a lot of Polish people, and uh, this song seems to be a thing. Carolina talked to me a little bit about it. I listened to, I don't know, maybe 30 seconds of it before I said to her, stop, stop, I need to do a reaction video of this. Um, so I have not heard it in its, in its entirety. And we're gonna react not only to the song itself, you know, the the audio of it, but we're also gonna react to the video, which I, I understand it's also quite important for uh, the delivery of the message. So I don't know much about Eva, so I pulled up her information here on, on Wikipedia. And it says here that Eva Farna is a Polish Czech pop rock singer. She released five Polish language and four Czech language studio albums and received platinum and gold certifications for for them. Wow, that's, that's I'm, I'm telling you, I mean, as a singer, so writer myself, um, this is quite a, quite a thing. She's released nine studio albums in two languages. The Farna is the youngest commercially successful singer in Czech Republic. So we have a celebrity in the house. She's uh, quite an accomplished musician. Seems interesting enough. So let's go and let's react to this music video. Okay, it's a nice painting. Uh, seems quite old. I don't know if it's a famous painting. I see all the women in the painting. So That is a nice hook. Hold on. How was that again? That is a very nice hook melody. I really like it. Very good, strong intro to the song. Boom, bing, boom, boom, da, 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 dun, dun. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, uh, very interesting. Um, she's very pretty, uh, has, has a very nice uh, voice so far from what I can see. I see different women here, different hair color. I, I still cannot gather much information from what I'm seeing, so let's keep going. I like the fact that like she's in the center of course so your eyes go to her but the fact that some women are facing you some of them their backs are facing the camera it actually creates the opposite effect the camera is not on them it's on the main subject which is you know Eva but it's quite the opposite I think they are positioned in a way so that your eye goes to some of them right so if you see someone that has your you know their back to you and then the next one has you know, it's looking towards you, then you're gonna look at them. Doesn't matter if uh, the main subject, which is Eva, is, is also in, in the picture. So from the perspective of filmmaking, I think it, it, it's done so that we can see those women. They have as much of a leading role as, as Eva, the, the, the singer. Nice. I love the effect on the voice, some reverb, makes it sound very modern. Okay. 
Okay, a quick pause. So I have the lyrics here, um, which Carolina helped me translate them. And the beginning says, I am not the same girl I was yesterday. Time turns us into women grateful for what I have and I do not have, right? This is how I see it. Also, I boldly look up. I feel it. Time has caught up with me. Time is running out and since it is running out, it will leave a trace behind. Let's talk about timing. When you talk about timing in context of a woman, I wonder if she's writing about, you know, the quote, quote unquote biological clock um, or, or just time itself and how it seems to, um, based on society, seems to affect women more or society makes it feel as if time passing for a woman is, uh, has, you know, more of an impact than a man. Something like that. So let's keep going. That's a great drop right there. Uh, Music-wise, from a producer's perspective, is a great drop. What is it said? What does the lyric say? Uh, something chavo. That's when, that's when the, the actual title of the song comes in. I think that's what she said. I think that's what she said. That's fantastic. From the perspective of, of, of the actual music video, some of the women are representing different things. I think different body shapes, different states of, of, of a woman's body. In the case of the one that is pregnant, well, she's obviously carrying a life. Then you have some of them. Uh, I, I, I just saw here uh, one that has like a scar. It was very fast. It was done. To, they introduced her quickly. But um, she has a scar on, on this side of her face. Okay, she changed clothes now and they have her in front of this painting. Before she was in, in the center of all the women, now she's in front of the painting, which again, there's a reference there um, between those two. She's also saying, I know my legs are not long, but they help me stand tall because it is, wow, that's a great line. I actually, I actually got goosebumps with that line, wow. That's heavy. It's a beautiful line. I think I think I know what this is about. I think this is about body acceptance. I think this is about um, understand. Um, let's keep going, okay? You see, for example, that shot there, where they're all they're all facing away from the camera. It's just the one facing the camera. But that's not done so that she is the main focus. Or the opposite. You're looking at the women. You know, you're looking at them, even though they have no faces because they are, you know, they are turning a, a away from the camera. But my eyes go immediately to, to all of them, but Eva, the singer. You see the lady that has scar here, like an indentation on the side of her face. They put her right next to Eva. You know, so they want to get your eye on this, but not only her, you see some of them have, um, I see some, some, some scars and some of them have some scars. Uh, look at the body. This one has some scar here in, there, in her stomach. Uh, she's pregnant and she has, you know, uh, striation marks. This one is missing a, a leg. Herself, you see? Herself, Eva, she has a scar uh, here on her belly, probably from when she was pregnant. Um, she has striation marks, which is, you know, it's quite common in, in uh, pregnancy. So many women are, are so self-conscious about those things. Uh, anyone would be. It's very difficult having something on your body that makes it, makes it look not natural, uh, especially in this day and age with, you know, social media, Instagram, and people, they just want to have perfect skin, they want to have perfect color, they have, you know, uh, filters um, that now they're not only you know, changing the color of your skin or the texture, but now they, they even change your, you know, the thickness of your lips. It's crazy. It's a great song. I like it. I get it. You know, the song is about, you know, body um, acceptance, you know, accept, accepting yourself and your body uh, the way you are. At least that's how I interpret it. Um, it's a beautiful message, to be honest. Uh, the, then I can see that the, um, the Internet has really um, embraced this song. It has already 1,300,000 uh, views. Um, most of them are, are likes and like, like, 
40,000 likes and to just 1,000 uh, dislikes, which is doesn't really mean that much in this day and age, uh, but it when you see uh, the ratio, it, it shows you that people, most people are, are liking the message and they're liking the song. I haven't gone into the into the comments of the video, um, but like I said, I've, I've seen quite a lot of people sharing something related to the song. I'm here trying to react to the to the video, but I'm also trying to react to the song. So it's like it's completely different things in my in my brain. Uh, when I'm listening to something in music, it's like I'm, I'm I'm using a certain part of the brain. But when I'm gathering visual information, it's it's like it's like a little bit different, but still great video. Uh, it puts a lot of things into perspective, especially for example, as a, La as a Latino, um, we, you know, the bodies are, are, I don't want to say that they are an important part of our culture, but, but they are. Um, women, you know, the more voluptuous and the more curves and uh, the clothes that they buy is a little bit more fitting, tight fitting. The guys also, you know, guys are trying to you know look good also you know and have their muscles showing and stuff like that um but at the end of the day i think that it, it has it's, it's a sword with two edges right uh, on one side yeah you're taking care of yourself because you're putting importance on your body but it's it's like one one view one scope of how a body is supposed to look and what is actually good looking or accepted um, in, in this society. Eva Farna, uh, if by any chance of life you ever see this video, which you probably you will never, um, you did a great job. And uh, thank you for spreading this message. Thank you for writing this song. And um, yeah, it's fantastic. Boom! That's all guys. That's the end of the episode. I hope you liked it. You know, reaction videos to me are interesting if the, if what I'm watching is interesting. Uh, and this particular video was interesting to me. The idea behind it, when Carolina told me a little bit what would kind of like, hey listen, this is this is making waves in, in, in Polish and I guess Czech internet. And I was like, I, I need to react to this because if, if I can use my platform to, first of all, to learn and if I can you know, show you guys something that you can extract some sort of knowledge from it, at least some sort of awareness, and finally to, to spread, to spread uh, the word on, on things that are valuable to us as societies, okay? And this one in particular, I'm honored to be able to um, react to it and show you my thoughts, okay? So guys, thank you very much. I hope you liked it and comment below your thoughts on this video um, show it to people spread when I mean this video I'm not talking about my video because that I'm talking about Eva Farna's video Chavo okay so send it to a friend send it to someone spread the word on, uh, on the, the beautiful message on this video okay thank you very much see you next week adios